Good morning everyone, hope you're having a good week. Um, if you watched our Sunday video, um, could think about liking and subscribing because it really helps us. Yeah, we had a loss of views on that one, so yeah. that's good. We haven't done a Sunday one for a while, we've sort of let it slip into Monday, but uh, but we've got quite a lot of views, so thank you. And um, We're nearing 7,000 subscribers. We're a little bit short still, but um, we're hoping in the next couple of vlogs to get that. So uh, if you don't subscribe, <laughs> please do so now. And the notifications, they're very important, so you don't miss any vlogs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, whilst we're here, um, overnight uh, we had a new patron, so that's Deborah. Uh, so hello, Deborah. Thank you. And Thanks. if you've had time to go back through the patron uh, posts, you may know what we're about to um, show everybody in this uh, vlog, but uh, you may not have looked yet, so it may be a surprise to you. But hello, Deborah, and thank you. And thank you to everyone that bought us coffees again this week. Yes, and I'm, I'm smiling because the dogs are sitting here looking at us. <laughs> they think we're going to go up into the attic, but we're not. No, not today. Anyway, what have we got for you today? Um, the last time we were in the tower here was a couple of uh, vlogs ago. And the last thing I was doing here, stripping all this um, plaster off, but downstairs I decided to sand a patch of wall um, just to see what the finish was like under all this plaster. And things took a bit of a turn after that, didn't they? Because yeah. <laughs> someone here noticed something. I just had a feeling about it, really. And what, what I'll do is I'll show you a, um, a still frame from that. And basically, just have a look at it to see if you can see anything unusual. Apart from me, that is, because I'm in it. Um, and also standing next to me, there's a, a granite block on the wall. We're not talking about that either. So ignore me and the granite block. And just see if there's anything you can spot that may be just a bit unusual. Okay. Did you see what we were talking about? What we've got is we've got a straight line here and there's a bit of cracking here. Um, so there's a straight line there and then, a f again you might not be able to see it, but there looks to be some sort of straight line here and then along here. And when I look at this, this looks quite smooth under this paint. So, we're wondering if something's been blocked up there. Um, maybe this was another window. Don't know. But it definitely looks square in shape. And the fact that this is quite smooth compared to everything around it, that could be another granite lintel. Um, it could be wishful thinking, of course, on our part. But we just noticed it, we didn't notice it last week. Um, so I'm gonna, let's have a look outside, see if there's any clues. Okay, this is going to be easy to film, but we'll, we'll use this window as a reference. And so I'm gonna come down to the level of the bottom of the window here, okay, where the glass is. And I'm gonna try and pan and keep as level as I can where I could see that flat piece there. And without tape measure, I'm estimating that that's roughly two feet below the window level. So let's go outside and have a quick look. Okay, so that's the window we were talking about. And if we come down a couple of feet, probably gonna be somewhere about here. And then we work along. That is going to, that area is going to be around the corner just above the roof level there so the only way we can see it is from the tower room so let's go and have a look up in the tower room see if we can find anything now there may be some glare so you're gonna to have to perhaps bear with me here okay so we haven't got great visibility from up here but I estimate somewhere about here would be this area 
Um, the only thing I can see, and I don't think it's showing on camera, there's a very, very slight ledge where some of the render sticks out, but there's nothing particularly obvious there. So if we now, oh, great. <laughs> Okay, I'm not going to get to that window very well. Let's see if I can just rig something up so I can get there. Uh, it's With all this in the way, it's a bit difficult to get up there, but I've just looked over. I can't see any evidence of any window there, but then it has been rendered at some point. Uh, but my thought is perhaps the barns were added later and therefore it would be very sensible to have a window on that side of the tower. Um... Well, there's only one way of finding out, really, and that's from the inside. Go ahead, then. It's the only way of doing it. doesn't look as though it's there by accident. Um, that looks very lintel-like. Wow. We weren't expecting that. But when you think about it, if those barns were built later, we've no, we've no idea when, when they were built. Uh, we just assumed it was all built at the same time. If they were built later, then Obviously, you'd want some light coming in on this side of the, the tower. So it makes sense, but of course it's, it's buried. So I suspect the next thing Susie's going to want me to do <laughs> is to get rid of all this. <sighs> right, well you're gonna need this. So what we've got, there's granite here and here, and it's going inwards. So this doesn't look as it's supported by much, but as that granite goes in, it will be supported. Like the one, like the one the up there. So it should be safe enough to get all this rubble out and see what's there. Um, but I just want to do it very carefully because I'm no structural engineer, but it should be fine, shouldn't it? There's no reason to think that there's nothing, you know. I'm hoping it's still got bars in, like that one. It, yeah, it, it, it may have a window in, but you know, um, the difficulty will be the other side of here. It's on that roof where there's just a thin gully. There's nowhere to work. Um, but I think if we just gingerly take this out 
and make sure there's no nothing untoward going on. Um, we can keep going back and back and see where we end up. So yeah, mm. exciting. We weren't expecting that today. No, I just kept looking at it and thinking it seems to have an outline. Yeah, and you were right. I hadn't noticed it even when I was taking the blast off. Did it? But then I wasn't really, I was just trying to get the mm. job done. I wasn't thinking about anything. Uh, but we've walked past it all week and haven't noticed anything. But today you suddenly noticed it. So, yeah. Right, <laughs> more mess. through to the window. How exciting. I'm hoping the metal bars are in there still. Well. And there's the window sill. Yeah. Uh, this will be for around it under here, presumably, hopefully. Obviously this needs cleaning up, but yeah. Yeah, and there's the hooks where the window would have been originally. Yeah, that's metal hook, so the window frame would have been on here. Mm. Um, it's a question of what's behind here, really, whether this is the barn wall or, or whether there's just a, a thin layer just... of bricks and this is above the guttering, so we need to mm. probably measure. But that's definitely a window. I think it's above the guttering. Yeah, we'll have to have to measure. I think so. We could drill in that corner mm. and see where we end up. But obviously, you'll have a hole then. We'll have to fill it.
Right, we've taken out all the stones from behind the bars and what you can see at the top is the guttering. So between the tower and the barn roof, uh, the water channels down into that guttering. And then at the bottom, you can actually see a, a big joist that's holding the roof rafters on. Now there's enough of a gap between the stonework and that joist to be able to slide up a piece of plasterboard. So what we're thinking um, is getting a piece of plasterboard in behind those bars, then uh, filling the gap behind that. And that'll be nice and neat. Um, and we might even be able to put a picture on there or something uh, to make it look as though it is a window. I don't know, we'll think about that. We could put light behind it. Or, or a light behind it, yeah, we could do. Mm. So we'll, we'll give that some thought, but uh, yeah, really interesting. All needs a bit of a clean up, but at the moment, we need to tidy up. Can't believe that amount of rubble has come out of that hole. <laughs> yeah, well worth doing. So here is window one, window two, the lovely Susie, and window three. However, Susie is not satisfied. <laughs> well, the tower has got four walls. Mm -hmm. It's not rounded. No. And I'm thinking there should be one here. So four walls and three windows. Yeah. So there's one missing, you're saying? But I don't know why they'd cover that up. I can understand that because... they built the barn. The barn's yeah. there. So what are you suggesting? Well, can we have a look to see maybe if there's another lintel here or something? Because it's they seem to go down at that angle, so maybe round there. Okay. I'll... Um... Get on to it. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, we're in a mess. Well, yeah, we're in a mess, I know, so I know there's going to be more mess. Might as well make more of a mess. Mm. Okay. We need some more stones anyway. Right. Oh, <laughs> my